from the minute they land, they're going to have access to cannabis, they're going to be able to smoke it wherever they need to smoke it, smoke and they're going to have a good time and it'll be stoner proof. A friend of ours, a former uh, CS Travel customer who used to book with April to yeah. Amsterdam, was working with the Hawaii Cannabis Expo, and they were looking for a travel partner, and he recommended April. So we that was the fire under our, our butts, so to speak, and yeah. we just created an agency so we could start booking travel, and we've been uh, you know gradually building it ever since. Located about 20 minutes away from Negril in Little Bay, Jamaica, and it's off the beaten path, so you have to go on a real bumpy road to get there. But once you get there, it's like its own little oasis, and you are secluded away from all the hustle and bustle, and they have their own cove, and once you're in that water and in the cove, it's like swimming in an aquarium. and his staff have, are committed to not just allowing people to smoke on the property, which is, you know, great, but they're actually developing and building a full uh, cannabis wellness center on the property. So they already have two greenhouses uh, full of cannabis that they're growing. They're also building a cannabis spa, too, and a health center, so it's a health education center, as well as all the fun and recreational stuff. And all of that is done in conjunction with the Bobo Shanti, uh, you know, uh, Rastafari church there. Uh, they're in partnership, uh, and so uh, the government is uh, fully behind it, and uh, it, it, they're moving fast. It's going to be a really uh, even more exciting place next year once, once all the new facilities open. 